sing Su Ti and Ho. Everybody say hello. There's Su Ti and Sweep, a panda called Su, and little cousin Scampi too. There'll be fun galore with the terrible four. Just you wait and see. It's Su Ti and Company. Su Ti and Company. Hello there. Hey, am I glad to see you? I can't get over how silly we were. We forgot to tell you that we were moving, didn't we? Anyway, I'm jolly glad that you managed to find us. And don't worry, because we are all here. Sooty, Sweet, Sue, Little Cousin Scampy, we've all moved up here, lock, stock and barrel, to the north of England. And what, I hear you ask, are we doing exactly? Well, we've got a shop. Actually, I inherited it from a very distant auntie. Welcome to Sooty and Co. This is our shop. This is our venture. We're all thrilled with it. And I expect you're wondering what we sell exactly. Well... Matthew! Matthew! <laughs> where on earth are you? It's all right, Sue. I'm here. I'm here. Oh, and I'm not alone, by the way, because uh, we've got company. What? <gasps> oh, goodness me! Oh, hello, everybody. It's so nice to see you all, isn't it? Mm hmm We were really worried, weren't we, Matthew? What, you mean about them not finding us, Sue? Yes. But well, don't worry, I've just explained that. And now that they're here, everybody's happy, right? Well, um, I'm afraid not, Matthew. What? Listen. Shh. Listen to that. Somebody's... Somebody's crying. It's coming from over here. It's not him. It's not him. Just a minute. I know who it is. Come on, up you come. Come on, up, 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 up. Look who it is. Sooty, and he's crying as well. What's, what's the matter, Sooty? You feeling homesick? But Sooty, this is your home. You're sick of it? The old ones are the best ones. Look, Sue, why don't you take Sooty upstairs and see if you can cheer him up a bit. Go on, the pair of you, go on, off you go. I'm sorry about this. I mean, I was going to show you around the shop, but I'm afraid that will have to wait. I'm going to have to go and try and cheer up that poor little teddy bear. Oh, uh, you could come and join us if you like. Come on. Come and join us. Oh, there, there, Sooty. Be a brave boy. There, there. <coughs> what, Sweep? <coughs> What's wrong with Sooty? <coughs> well, he's a bit upset, that's all. <coughs> Why? Well, we've just moved house, haven't we? <coughs> Yes, and sometimes moving to a new place can be a little bit upsetting if you're sensitive. Unsettling. <coughs> you're not upset. <coughs> well, you're not exactly sensitive either, are you? Oh, there, there, Sooty. I mean, here I am, looking after Sooty, giving him support. <coughs> what are you giving him? <coughs> you could give him a lick of your bone. <coughs> what? Sweep, you great Lincoln poop! Look what you've done now. He's fainted. Hey, come on, you lot! You're not arguing already, are you? Oh, come on, Sooty, stand up. Oh, for goodness' sake, cheer up as well. Come on, it's terrible seeing you like this. Look, can't you give me a little smile? No. Oh, please smile, Sooty. Look, I'd do anything to make you smile. Anything? Well, yes, anything. I, I promise. You just thought of something that will make you smile. Well, apparently, it's thought of something that will. Ah, uh, uh, no, 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 well, I'm not no, doing no, that. Matthew, uh, you did promise. Well, well, yes, but that was before uh, that. <coughs> it's to cheer Sooty up. <coughs> well, well, yes, but... Uh, I mean, oh, come along, <coughs> Matthew. It's just a little reminder of the old days. What? Something to cheer up the poor little chap. Oh, just a little reminder of the old days. Hmm. Something to cheer up the poor little chap. All right, go on then, do it. <coughs> <coughs> Feeling happier now, are you? <laughs> God, just a little reminder of the old days. Something to cheer the poor little chap up. Well, they won't catch me out again. Oh, hello there. Hey, I was in the middle of showing you a lot around, wasn't I? Well, as you can see, this is my bedroom. It's wonderful, isn't it? Lots of room, lots of space on the floor for hanging my clothes up and things. And it... Hey, look at that. It's moving. I hope it's not a mouse. Ooh, horrible, nasty things. I... Oh, <laughs> it's little cousin Scampy. Hey, I was just telling this lot. Uh, oh, he's crying as well. What's the matter, Scampy? What's wrong? You just heard what Sooty did to me. What, the custard pie? 
Oh, bless him. He's concerned. What? Well, he's not concerned. He's jealous. Well, listen, you are not going to push a pie in my face, that's for sure. I let Sooty do it. Well, yes, but you see, that was because Sooty was feeling upset. Don't tell me. You're upset as well. Well, no way, young man, are you pushing a pie into my eye. Not even a little one. Not even a tiny one. What? Can you squirt me in the face? No, you cannot. You must be joking. Ha! How do you like that? He wants to squirt me with his water pistol. This is all because Sooty was feeling a little bit homesick. Well, he can forget it, the little squirt. <laughs> Talking of little squirts. Oh, dearie me. That is a tiny water pistol. Look at the size of that. Pathetic, isn't it? Look, I'll tell you what, Scampy. Because I'm feeling so big-hearted, and because I would hate for you to feel homesick, you can do it. Go on. Come on, young man. Give it all you've got. Come on. <laughs> Why do I have to open my big map? Well, as you can see, we have moved, but certain things remain exactly the same. They are naughty, that lot, aren't they? Mind you, I can never stay mad with them for long. Oh, I was in the middle of showing you around, wasn't I? Well, as you can see, this is a little kitchen area. Not very large, but big enough for us. And this is the uh, lounge. Over here, this is the dining area. And over this side of the room, come on over here, this is the desk, and this is where I get to do most of my paperwork. Matthew, ah, oh, Matthew. Oh, hi, Sue, what is it? Well, look, we found something. Oh, what is it? Um, oh, it's, a, it's an old fountain pen, actually, Sue. Oh, what, like a biro? Uh, no, 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 no. Th these pens, you had to fill them full of real ink. Actually, it could be a real pain, you know, because they were very messy and the ink used to get absolutely everywhere. Mm, can Sooty have a look? Well, yes, all right. Hold on to it, Sooty. But listen, be very, very careful with it because there may still be some... Uh, <laughs> there may still be some ink in it! Look at me! Look at me! Just look at me! Oh, he didn't do anything, Matthew. He what? just squeezed it a little bit, that's all. He wants to be very, very careful I don't squeeze him a little bit. Oh, <laughs> stop being such a grumpy trousers. What? Come on, you haven't shown them the best bit yet. What's that? Oh, of course! The shop! The shop! Come here! This is what is known as the sharp end of the stick because this is the shop. Have a look around. Now, as you can see, we sell just about anything and everything. And that is the beauty of a shop like this. We sell just about anything. Oh, hello, Sooty. Oh, yes, and we buy almost anything as well. What have we sold so far, Matthew? Uh, so far, nothing, Sue, actually. And uh, what have we bought so far? So far, um, nothing, actually. What? Really? Apparently, Sooty has bought some stock in for the shop. <laughs> that's brilliant. Uh, listen, so they were fantastic value. Well, that's what I like to hear. Exactly what is it? Oh, oh hi, sweet. Hi, sweet. What, what? There's been a delivery. A delivery? Is this what you've bought, Sooty? Really? Uh, are they in the yard, Sweep? Well, come on, action stations. Go and bring them in. Go on. Hey, this is very exciting. Our very first delivery. Oh, look at that. I'll tell you what, Sooty, whatever it is you've ordered, you certainly seem to have got uh, plenty of them. Uh, Sooty, come back here. Uh, what is it exactly? You're a bit busy. Uh, wow, fancy ordering stock in for a shop like this. It's very clever, you know. I'm very, very impressed, and I can't wait to see what's inside the boxes. It's obviously something very light. Maybe it's uh, gloves or socks or something like that. Uh, Sooty, come here. Listen, what, what is it exactly that you've... Um, you're still busy. Uh, sweep, how many boxfuls are there? Plenty more where these came from. Goodness me, I think I better just check, have a look, see what he has bought. Make sure he hasn't bought anything that we can't sell. Just have a quick look inside. Oh, no, look at, look at that. Completely empty. I'm going to have to have a word with the suppliers about this. Let's have a look. No, look, this one's empty as well. And this one, they're all completely up. We've been done. Sooty, come up here, come up. Listen, listen, listen. I want you to stay nice and calm, but something very serious has happened. What do I mean? Well, stay calm. How many did you order of whatever it was that you did order? Hmm? 2,000. 2,000? Oh, no, Sooty, they've all gone missing. Uh, what did you actually order? Boxes. Boxes? It's, just a minute. You ordered 2,000 empty boxes? 
You cannot be serious, man! What is all the fuss about, Matthew? I'll tell you what the fuss is about. So this, 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 this teddy bear has just ordered 2,000 empty boxes. We are now the proud owners of 2,000 cardboard boxes. <coughs> That's not strictly true. What do you mean? What? Well, um... Well, well, what, Sue? What? Well, the man on the van said that he had a few extra that we could have cheap, so we, um, so we, uh... So you what? <laughs> you bought them? Yes, only another thousand. We'll bring them in, Matthew. They're out here in the yard. Come on, sweep. Another thousand? Come, come back here. What are we going to do with three thousand cardboard boxes, all of which are completely empty? You think of something? Well, right now, I'm busy thinking of something that I could do with you. As a... That's the telephone. That is what is known as being saved by the bell, young man. Where's the phone? Oh, it's here. Yes, yes. Hello. Yes, this is Sooty & Co. Yep. Oh, the showroom. What, the transport? It's ready now. Yes. Pretty snazzy. OK, we'll be down directly. That right. Oh, uh, listen, listen. Are you there? Yes. Listen, do you take empty cardboard boxes in payment? <laughs> look, will you go and get Scampy down here to look after the shop whilst we go to the showroom and get the transport? Go on, off you go. Actually, we've been waiting for that phone call for quite a long time because you can't run a shop like this without transport to deliver things and collect things. Actually, wait till you see what they've got. It's brilliant. Oh, and the man in the shop said that I got something pretty snazzy as well. So, uh, i better get myself cleaned off, then I'll go for the transport. 3,000 cardboard boxes, all of which are empty. I don't... Manchester is one of the only cities in Britain to have real working trams. So this was the way Sooty Sweep and Sue decided to travel. Luckily, Sue is grown up enough and has my permission to be in charge of the three of them. Here she is, getting a ticket from the ticket machine. They're having a great time. Really wonderful. Still, never mind because uh, this will be my last journey by foot. Remember what the man from the garage said? Something a bit snazzy for me. Anyway, it's a very nice day for a jog, so uh, excuse me. Mr. Lamont. I've got them, boys. I've got the keys to the new vehicle. It's all right. It's all right. I think I managed to shake him off. Actually, this is the place where we are due to pick up the new shop transport. 
And I think I've actually managed to beat that lot to it. Cooey, Matthew. Ah, Sue. Did Sue. you enjoy your stroll? But just a minute, you're here. Of course we're here. We've been here for ages. Sooty and Sweep are just bringing the vehicle. What? Now? Mm. Here? Yes. What? Where? Look. Where? Whoa! Look at this! Look! Hey! This is... Look, look, look! This is... Brilliant! It's fantastic. Mm. It's amazing. Mm. It's wicked. Mm. Fantabulous. Sue, you better get on your way. Um, whereabouts is my transport? Uh, your transport's behind the blue one, Matthew. <gasps> Have what? a nice journey. Bye. Yeah, bye, bye. Hey, climb aboard, Sue. OK? Right. Take it away, boys. Bye. Better go and check out my vehicle now, behind the blue one. Look at this. The one behind the blue one. It's a beauty. Look at this! Matt's machine? Who'd ride an old croc like this? An old croc like you! I hope your van breaks down! Of course, their van didn't break down because it was brand spanking new and it went like a dream. My transport, on the other hand, was as old as the hills and it went like a nightmare. <laughs> oh, you're back already? You've been back for ages, Matthew. Your dinner's in the oven, just needs heating. The camper van's terrific. Thank you for telling me that, Sweep. It's really made my day, is that? Oh, yes, and there's some more news, Matthew. Um, it's about Scampy. What? Well, don't, don't tell me. Don't tell me. I, can't, I couldn't bear it. It's bound to be a disaster. No, it isn't at all. Whilst we were out, Scampy made a sale. What? Give him the note, Sooty. What note? I've sold a very large item for £20. I've put all the boxes somewhere useful, love Scampy, sold... Well, well, well! Where is the little chap? <coughs> hiding. Riding? No, no, riding. He meant he's riding his bike. Look, why don't you sit down and have your tea, Matthew? No, oh, no, no, so actually, I'm pooped. I'm going to have an early night. Oh, do you know something? Running a shop is harder work than you would believe. And actually, I can hear a nice, comfortable bed just calling to me, so I'll bid you night-night. I've sold a very large item for £20. What on earth can he have sold for £20? Oh, dear. We know what he sold, don't we, boys? <laughs> <laughs> Do you know, I still can't work out what he sold to get £20. And another thing, what did he do with 3,000 empty cardboard boxes? Still, life is full of little mysteries, so I shall bid you night-night, everybody. Night-night. <laughs> Ah! 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 The boxes! He sold my bed! Bye bye, everybody! Bye bye! He sold my bed! Scampy He sold my bed! to Sooty and Co. What? Can you say hello? No, not at the moment, because I'm talking to them. I've got something very, very important to tell them. 
Is this the face of someone who is very proud? Is this the face of someone who has just received a major achievement? What's the tea? It's the face of somebody who boasts a lot. Well, maybe that's because I've got something to boast about. Look what arrived in the post for me today. Hmm? What is it? I thought you'd never ask. This young man is my Nawi certificate. The National Association of Underwater Instructors. And this is to prove that I am a qualified underwater Diver. When did this happen? Well, you know the last time I was on holiday? Well, I took the diving course and I took an exam, which I passed with flying colours. And now I'm qualified to dive anywhere in the world, underwater, with the tanks on my back and everything. See this photograph here? This is a picture of me abroad on my last dive. And uh, what? You're a qualified diver too? D d you? A qualified... Qualified diver? Hang on, a scuba diver with, with the tanks on your back and everything like that? Yeah, you must be joking. Look, go and play a little game with your little friends. Go on, go on, go on, off you go. Play a little game, off you go. Sooty, a qualified diver? <laughs> Bubbles. Ooh, look at this sweep. I've got one on the end of my thingy. It's a beauty, too. Can you sniff it? Well, you can, but I don't think they smell of anything much. What sweep? It's not there anymore. No, that's because you burst it with your nose, you silly dog. They're only made from soap, you know. What sweep? You've got some soap up your nose. Oh dear, I think I know what's going to come next. Oh, sweep! Look what you've done now. You've knocked over the bubble mixture and that's all there is. Doesn't matter, why not? Because... Oh, no you don't. You're not pulling that one on me. You spilt mine, which means that I take yours. So, bubbles! And, talking of bubbles, look at those beauties. Is that you, Matthew? Oh, it's you, Sooty. Hey, come down here and we can blow bubbles together. What? Can you play? Well, not unless you've got some bubble mixture, sweet, which you haven't. I'm afraid the answer is no. So off you pop. 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 So it seems that Sweep has to get himself some more bubble mixture if he's going to join the bubble-blowing fun. Well... Being Sweep, he didn't want to go down to the shop and buy some bubble mixture. He decided to make some himself. Sue had told him that the bubbles were made from soap. And so that's what he was using to make the mixture. Soap. And plenty of it, too. Shh! Listen. Silence. That is music to my ears. And do you know why? because it means that that lot are actually playing nicely. Do you know the other place you get silence like that is when you're diving? When you are 60 feet beneath the waves, the only noise is the noise of the bubbles gently rising. <sighs> ah, yes. I remember being down underneath the ocean and just hearing those bubbles gently going to the surface. Ah, yes. When you're diving, there's just you, the water, the little fishes, and the gentle sound of the bubbles rising. But anyway, I can't hang around here talking to you. I've got a shop to run, so, uh, excuse me. Was I imagining things, or, 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 or was it... I mean, did... was it... <coughs> sorry. That's silly. Sorry. Sorry. Uh... Sorry, that time. I'm right. There are bubbles coming. There's something inside this water butt. There's something down there. I'm going to find out exactly what it is. Now, it may just be the leaves releasing the gas. Or it could be a small frog. But there's definitely something inside there, and I'm going to find out exactly what it is. There is de... I've got... Oh! 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 Look! Look at that! Oh! 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 Ah! Oh! So whilst oh! I was having trouble oh! with air bubbles downstairs, Sweep was just about to have trouble with air bubbles upstairs. You see... He wasn't very happy with his bubble mixture. He felt it needed stirring more, and so he thought he would use my battery-operated air compressor to give it a lift. But as often happens with Sweep, he got more than he bargained for.
Oh, hello there. I shall have to have a sit down. All that business with the bubbles. I've come over all funny. Did you see that stick waving around like that? When I think of some of the creatures that are lurking at the bottom of the ocean, I dread to think what's at the bottom of our water, but... Do you know something? In all my diving experience, I have never seen anything like that. Um, I don't suppose you'd like to buy some balloons, would you? No? No, I didn't think you would. Nobody else does either. We've had this lot for absolutely ages. Ah, oh, here you are, Matthew. I oh, was hello, wondering Sue. where everyone was. Uh, just a minute, I thought you were playing upstairs. No, Sooty was blowing bubbles with me, but he got bored ages ago. And Sweep is sulking. Ah. Everything's a bit boring. Mm. Have you been doing anything exciting, Matthew? No, not really, Sue. Just wrestling with a giant squid in the water butt, that's oh, all. Oh, Matthew, you are a silly sausage. Don't tell such porky pies. What do you mean, porky pies? I'm not telling... Look, come with me, come with me. Come on, come on. I'll, I'll show you. Come on. And so, whilst I returned to do battle with the monster of the deep, Sweep was doing battle with a bathroom full of bubbles. Ah, but, but this is unbelievable. You've seen nothing yet, Sue. Watch this. <gasps> oh. Just a minute. Amazing. We haven't you? even started yet, Sue. Um, Scratch my back, please. Oh, 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 oh. I can't believe what I'm seeing. Sue, you have seen Diddly so far. Watch this. My keys. Oh, dear. Oh, what a shame. I've dropped my keys into the water, but what on earth will I do? I have... Look, look my flabber is ghasted. Look at that. What Sue... can be living in there, then, Matthew? Sue, I don't know. I haven't actually... Uh, I haven't seen it yet. Well, why don't you put your hand in and get it out? I think you should. Uh, um... Well, uh, actually, I don't think we're better had. I think we're better just, you know, leave it. Uh, just... uh, you're not frightened, are you, Matthew? Me? Hmm. <laughs> a qualified nowy diver, frightened of something that's in the water, but of course not. I'll soon sort this out. It's probably a cat down there that's holding its breath for a very long time. No giant squid. That's that's a killer whale in there, Sue. I caught a glimpse of it. It was horrible. It was awful. It was it was fifty feet long. It was a hundred feet long. It was the most dreadful thing that you've ever seen. It was hideous. It was it was it was it was, it was sooty. Oh, silly old Matthew. It was sooty all the time wearing his scuba diving kit. Oh. Did you know that he's a fully qualified underwater diver, Matthew? But, well, uh, yes, I did. Listen to me, young man. I want you out of that cold water immediately into a nice warm bath. Off you go. Go on. Now. <sighs> I knew it was him all the time. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Sooty. Soon have you nice and warm. Oh, hello, Sweep. What are you doing? Nothing. What are we doing? Well, Sooty's just been swimming in the water butt, and now he needs to jump into a nice warm bath. We can't. What on earth do you mean? The bathroom's full. No, don't be silly. The bathroom can't be full. It's full to overflowing. Well, I don't see how that's possible, since you're standing there, Sooty and I are here, and Matthew's downstairs. You're pulling our legs, aren't you? You're not? Oh, stand to one side, Sweep. We're going in there. You're talking a load of old bubbles. Ah, Sweep! Ah! Oh, yeah, all right, all right, all right. You don't have to tell me. I know all about it. Sweep filled the bathroom full of bubbles, didn't he? Yep, and then they all spilled out and Sue got covered and Sooty got covered. I heard the scream from down here. But don't worry, because that was over half an hour ago. We've cleared all of the bubbles up now and I've warned Sweep not to do it again. Ah, and here's a warning for you as well. Do not play in butts of water. Now, it's different for Sooty because he's a qualified scuba diving teddy bear. But for little children, water can be very, very dangerous. So, watch it. Okay. Oh, hi, Sooty. Oh, sweet, sweet. There's something that I'd like you to watch as well. What is it? Well, I know how fond you are of bubbles, so I wondered if you would like to see my magic floating bubble. You would? 
OK. Uh, Sooty, can we have some uh, dimmed lights, please? And some, some sort of music that magicians use, OK? Thank you very much. Watch this sweep. My magic floating bubble. See the silken handkerchief. See the silken handkerchief and the magic words. Izzy Wizzy, let's get busy and... <gasps> Look at that. The magic floating bubble. Look at that. And down it goes and... Oh, 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 oh. It's time to get away, sweep. Oh, it's going over there, sweep. Whoa, it's going up in the air, sweep. Let's see if we can get it back on the top. Yes, look at that. And down it goes. Down, oh, 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 oh. down, 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 down. That was brilliant. It was good. Life, please, Sooty. It was sitting on the handkerchief. You're right, sweep. It was sitting on top of the handkerchief. And then he was trying to fly away. He was. He was. You're right. <laughs> How exactly does it work? Well, Sweep, it's magic, of course. Just pure magic. Let's see if we can get it to do it once more. Izzy, Wizzy, let's get busy. <gasps> oh, yes, it's flying away that way. And oh, it's flying away that way. And Sweep, all you have to do is to say the magical words, Izzy, Wizzy. Let's get... Sooty. You've given the entire game away now. Look at that. Does that mean it wasn't really magic? No, it wasn't really magic, sweetie. It's just a trick that I had in the back of the shop. You feeling a bit disappointed? Oh, sweet. Don't be too disappointed. Look, 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 look. I tell you what, look. Um, balloons, they're a bit like bubbles, aren't they? Why, why don't you take some of these balloons and go and play with those? Go on, go on, off you go. Go on. Uh, what? You want to play with some balloons as well? Uh, just, just, no, 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 Sooty. These are different. These are those modelling balloons. You know the balloons you make little models out of? What? You want to make some balloon models? Do you? I didn't realise you got that much puff. All right, off you go. Go on, take them away and uh, start blowing. <laughs> well, I told Sweep to go and play with the balloons, but what I'd forgotten was that Sweep simply hasn't got enough puff to blow up balloons. Some people can and others can't. And Sweep's one that can't. So, he's decided that since he doesn't have enough puff and he can't fill it full of air, then he'll just have to fill it with something else. Watch this. This place has been a hive of activity since you were here last. Actually, I'm very, very impressed. Sooty, sit down, take it down, take it down. As a matter of fact, I haven't even seen the balloon models yet. He said he was waiting for you lot to get back. Oi, they're here. Come on up, come on up. Look, there, there they are. The models are ready. Are they? What are we going to see first? A little French poodle. Apparently, we're going to see Sooty's version of a little French poodle. Is that it? Is that... Uh... That's the French Poodle, is it? <clears throat> French Poodle. What? The next one's much better. I'm glad to hear it. What is it? <gasps> go and get it. Go on. Go and bring it up. We are going to see that most elegant creature of the water, a swan. Just a minute. Is that it? <clears throat> a swan. See this? One popped poodle. You see, Sooty decided he didn't like his balloon models either, so he popped a lot of them. Matthew! Oh, oh, Matthew! Yes, Sue? You know I don't like to be a telltale tit. Yes, but... Well, it's just that Sweep's filled a load of balloons full of water and he's got them all in the bedroom. What? Mm. You're joking! You know, Sue, sometimes, just sometimes, I'm glad that you are a telltale tit. I'll deal with this. Sweep! Suze, tell me what you're doing with those balloons. You are not allowed those balloons in the bedroom. I want those balloons down here, and I mean now. <laughs> that dog, honestly. <gasps> oh. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, listen, sweet, cheer up. It was only a misunderstanding, and I'm not really cross with you, you know. He only did what you told him to, Matthew. Yes, I know that, Sue. Come on, sweet, give us a little smile. No? What, sweetie? He needs something to cheer him up. Well, I realise that, but what can we do to cheer him up? You've got the very thing. It's all right, sweet, so... Oh, look, the magic wand. It seems we're going to have some magic. Go on, then, sooty. <laughs> yeah, what do you think, sweet? What do you think? You'd rather there were bubbles? Well, you know what to do. Stand by, there's going to be some more magic. Hey, look at that! Oh, he's happy now, but then who wouldn't be with a room full of bubbles and balloons? <laughs> bubbles and balloons, who could ask for anything more? Bubbles and balloons in the air. And on the floor Not long ago I know There were problems With bubbles Like snowflakes Growing and Growing like mad But things are okay Now Everything is just fine Yes, things are okay Now we're having a really great time Bubbles and balloons Who could ask for anything more? Bubbles and balloons In the air and on the floor Out in the yard I hardly believe my eyes Bubbling water I hold have stayed well away But things are okay now Everything is just fine Yes, things are okay now We're having a really great time Bubbles and balloons Who could ask for anything more? Bubbles and balloons in the air and on the floor When later on I wrongly said throw those things You were just joking I ended up soaking wet But things are okay now Everything is just fine, yes things are okay enjoyed the show. If you have, don't forget to join us at Sushi Co. very shortly. Until then, bye-bye, everybody. Bye-bye.